Smart Stacking is a unique program because it's going to allow us to reactivate our fleet at a much faster pace. We knew that we were going to have to do something different with these generation of rigs. They're so automated and there's so much computer controls and PLCs. We were afraid that if you just welded the door shut and the humidity took over, they would never restart, ever. With a cold stacked rig, you're walking into a lot of unknowns. You're most likely starting the rig up with personnel who don't know anything about the rig. They don't know how long it's going to take to get up and running. Nine times out of ten, when you go back to work from being coal stack, you're changing out blowers, you're changing out motors, you're changing out centrifugal motors. They just don't ever get run. Most operators look at warm stack and smart stack very similarly. The challenge in the industry is people use those words interchangeably and they're not actually interchangeable. So often people will say warm stack, meaning that the rig actually has an engine running and people on board. But the question is, are they keeping the maintenance up? Are they servicing the BOPs? Are they staying in line with current regulations? If you're not taking a hot rig, what's the next best thing? And that's the goal for us for SmartStack is to get the next best thing we could to a hot rig rolling right off of an existing drilling contract. So it's really how can we get the best possible reliability in the machine and in the people. It's in Las Palmas, we put four rigs side by side, share power, share crew. We have better access to each vessel. It's safer to travel back and forth to each vessel. If we need to 12 people working on one rig, uh, off we go, uh, that's, we can change it, adopt to the situation uh, straight away. We have a detailed procedure and checklist that tells you how many times to function a piece of equipment for that specific rig. It's all about keeping the equipment safe in a working and operable state um, so that when we do go back to work, uh, we have a minimal risk of incidents. You don't have the potential failures of equipment or things like that that can put people in harm's way. So it just fits into the full puzzle of our HSE policy and our HSE belief that everything we do, we do geared towards the safety of the employee. What makes us different from our competitors is our crew a team of experts. And we managed to save those guys by keeping him on board. Being smart stack, you're here every day. So you're keeping your upper level people, your ADs, drillers, tool pushers. They get to stay fresh with the equipment, it makes a better team. It's a big advantage whenever you go back to work. Having people familiar with the work, doing the work, and going out with the rig, it's gonna be a much safer operation for the people on board that rig. Even the people that are new to that rig are gonna benefit greatly from having that experienced crew on board mentoring them. They wanna make sure that when these rigs do go back to work, that they know they're gonna be the ones with it and they take pride in those vessels. And they wanna make sure that they can show our clients that we do things a little different and that we make sure our vessels are always gonna be running tip top shape. I think the smart stacking and the uniqueness of it really fits well with the culture of our company. We're a flexible company with new ideas, uh, creativity, and trying to figure out ways to solve problems for the customers. And the smart stacking is one of those problem solving aspects that we've done with rig maintenance and with rig preservation. Smart stack allows us to be ready to go to work within 90 days, and so we can actively bid for work that's in the very short term. For clients, it's really how can we get the best possible reliability in the machine and in the people. And that was our goal, is to try and duplicate a hot rig as best we could. And we feel we've done a good job with that with SmartStack.